part four. In this video, we will continue to examine the muscles of the lower limbs. Let us begin with making a quick sketch of the rear view lower limbs. As before, I will draw the skeletal structure of the lower limbs in the contrapposto position. In the contrapposto position, the center of gravity of the human body vertically projects onto the footprint of the supporting leg so that the whole weight of the body is supported by just one leg. Another leg helps keep the body balanced. Here, you can see that the tilt of the thigh bone is not the same as the tilt of the shin bone. There are two bones in the lower leg, the tibia, or shin bone, and the fibular, or calf bone. I will draw the muscles with red pencil. The gluteus medius muscle originates from the outer surface of the ilium bone of the pelvis and inserts into the top projection of the thigh bone. This muscle helps move the upper leg away from the body and sideways. The hamstring group of muscles is located on the back of the thigh. It resembles a cylindrical mass and covers most of the rear portion of the upper leg. The hamstring group consists of three muscles. They all originate from the sitting bone of the pelvis. The hamstring muscles insert, via tendons, into both sides of the shin bone and calf bone, below the knee joint. The triangular pit between these muscles is called the ham. That is where the name of the hamstring muscles originates from.